believe it or not, I am your prison. Well, not, not yours. And, and not yours. I know. I know what you're thinking, Joe. Joe, what, what are you, a madman? Aren't you afraid to go on stage with war? They kill every president, and every president, they, they just kill him. Well, well, don't worry, I'm not. I'm, I'm, I'm not. I've had it from a good source that war are Trump-hating libtards, and therefore, I have nothing to do. I've had a, a very, very reproductive year in the White House. Oh, productive, reproductive, I don't know. I've refilled the swamp and restored gas prices to pre-pandemic highs. I'd like to celebrate the unparalleled success of our military victory in Afghanistan. The longest war in American history is finally over. To continue our policy of spreading American values of freedom, <coughs> liberty, and equality throughout the world, we have teamed up with the Taliban, who assure us that in the new Afghanistan, women will have equal rights and full protection under the law. They will honor the diversity of cultural heritage of the Afghan people. They will practice principles of religious freedom and tolerance. Within a few short months, we can assure you that the Afghan people will be wearing bikinis, rollerblading, and playing rock and roll in the streets. Hey, come Mr. Taliban, tell me banana. <laughs> Give me a hug. What do you say, pal?